Hey everyone, it's Leslie from Marvelous Art Studios. Happy New Year. Hope you had a great one. And I know I did. I took a long um, time to just kind of not do anything for a while. Uh, probably because I got sick. But <laughs> I'm back at it and I'm ready to finish a project that I've been wanting to get to. So I've started quilting it and I've finished quilting with black thread. I happen to like using... This is Magnifico from Superior Threads. It's a 40 weight, 100% polyester. It has a little bit of a pretty sheen to it, but it's not terribly noticeable in this, this particular piece. I always use with the 40 weight thread on the top. I love to use the uh, 50 weight. This happens to also be a polyester uh, from So Fine. So that's gonna be how I quilted it. And as I came down, I started adding some color to that bold, beautiful graphic, black and white text. So I began with a large scale. Now it's not large in as the blooms are, but it's large, it's cut large. So it's at least six inches tall. Then I, my color theme that I picked was the pink, turquoise, uh, a little bit of orange or peach, whatever you want, want to call it. And then I brought in black, and a light color or white. So this is how I like to operate. I like to pick three main colors, pink, peach, and turquoise in this case. And then I add a pop of the black and a pop of the lighter white. And some of these flowers do act as white because they, the, the value of them is whiter. And so I've layered them in in different scales, tiny, tiny scales of orange and turquoise to a larger scale. And then I've overlapped them. I filled in a V kind of with a grouping of these small little fun orange flowers. Wish I had more of these. I don't even know where I got them but or what brand they are. But at any rate, there there's just a few left. So I'm going to use them up and get them into this little piece. You can see where I tuck a, a white, well not white, but the light pink underneath the black. I might add a little pop of orange right in this space, maybe over here too, as I fill in and maybe around here. But I'm pretty happy with the overall space that's left. I like that it looks like a garden. And so all this space here, I'm going to leave white. It's a place for the eye to rest before it reaches that bold graphic. So that's what I'm doing today. And I'll get ready to be steaming it. And I'll be talking and showing you more about it later. Thanks for watching.